Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I welcome you here tonight to this beginning of the little conference about ARP and the US. Uh, I'm very happy that we were able to get to so many interested people together and so many speakers from all over the world. And uh, I would suggest uh, that Loretta will introduce to you Catherine Kraft, who she will do an introduction for the first a review about the, the aspects of uh, what ARP has done for the United States, and the art and the influence there. But great, great thanks to the American Academy that we have the possibility to uh, have the, this conference done in this wonderful place. I must admit, this is really overwhelming. And in fact, it's the best place for ARP to be represented. Mainly to uh, Ms. Wallis, uh, thank you for all your help. And uh, to Gary Smith, who is not here today. And thanks to all you, the speakers coming from New York and from London and anywhere. So it's wonderful to be, have you here and that you took the time to give us some new ideas about what's going on and wh what uh, will be also for any interested people for the world of art. And thanks, of course, to uh, uh, Ms. Steinkamp. Here she is, our curator, who has done all the organization to uh, get this done and have it prepared. And uh, well, this is <coughs> The point, uh, this is the first time here in Berlin that we have, after having started our storage uh, capacities here in, in Berlin in Moabit, uh, that we have this little conference started. And uh, tomorrow we have changed the plan, the invitation of Loretta, um, which we wanted to for the barbecue, an American barbecue, to have her in her Potsdam place in Sacro. We had, due to the bad weather, to change. And we will now be together in our storage capacities in Moabit tomorrow. She will, uh, but I think Loretta will tell you a bit about it. Well, uh, Loretta, I think you should do an introduction uh, to, for Catherine Kraft, uh, coming from the National Sculpture Institute from Dallas, so far away. And I understood just now, a second before I had the opportunity to talk to you, that uh, Nasha he was the first to buy a sculpture from Arp and to give it as a gift to his wife, the torso with the bulbs. I think this is the right expression. So uh, this is very interesting to, to know and to realize. Well, I'm very curious about the outcome of this little conference. And uh, thank you for all your interest and coming here. And all the best. And Loretta, the word is for you. Um, well, thank you also, a very warm welcome from um, Daniel Tümpel and myself. We've been working with the ARP Stiftung now for more than five years. And I have to say it was such a joy to see under your chairmanship, Engelbert and Maya, to see how the foundation has really uh, pursued its endeavor to focus on supporting scientific research on ARP for the last five years. And I think this conference is another highlight in the way to going even further. And I'm sure it will be a great chance to learn more about ARP, to get new views on ARP, and also to kind of rejuvenate the discussion upon ARP, which is your explicit aim. Thank you, everybody, for coming here tonight. Before introducing Catherine Kraft, I want to share something with you I saw today um, in the German press, and I had to laugh very much about it. Do you know the TIP magazine? It is um, here in Berlin, it's something like the um, Time Out or the New York Magazine in New York. And there was a little review on the Hans Arp exhibition, which the um, Stiftung initiated and which will be opening Friday at the Georg Kolbe Museum in cooperation with the Georg Kolbe Museum. And um, I wasn't aware, do you know the word of the dad bob? I didn't know about that expression. It's obviously, as it said here, the new trend word in American lifestyle blogger scene. 
and the dad bob is the contrary to the six pack. And you see this photo of the navel of Hans Arp, and it's um, written about the dad bob, dad meaning a body of a dad. So the people who drink a bit too much beer and don't do exercise anymore. <laughs> they are the dad bobs. They don't have the six pack of their 20s anymore. And Hans Arp is named as the um, ultimate dad bob. <laughs> And I was, I was thinking, if this is where this conference is going and the show is going, we'll have a lot of fun together. <laughs> and next to it is the ad of the um, new exhibition on homosexuality in Berlin, here in Berlin. So um, I can <laughs> encourage you all to go and see the show and also other shows taking place here in Berlin during your stay here. <laughs> um, Catherine Kraft, I'm sure you have um, deeper insights into a to share with us <laughs> than the dad, Bob. 